Saggies, and welcome to your 18 and over sexual tarot reading. So what mm -hmm. we're going to do today is we are going to see what's going on the first half of the month, the second half of the month, and see how you're leaving the month. If you want to dig a little deeper at the end of the video, we'll have an extended in a description box down below. First, let's shuffle some cards. Let's see what we have going on for the first half of the month of December. OMG. All right. So also friendly reminders that tarot is for guidance and entertainment purposes only. Therefore, not responsible for what you do after your reading. However, I'm here for you. OK, um, so what I'm seeing right off the bat is we are getting nice and cozy. OK, it's winter time at this point. Basically, it's basically winter time and we are in a season to cuddle. OK, this is the time where we need to get in and snuggly with someone, get nice and warm, okay? And all these things over here that I'm seeing, I'm seeing someone having their arm around you or near you, or it's feeling very comfortable, that's the point. And things are just look like you're going really, really well over here. So, it's cuddly time. What are we doing during this cuddly time? Let's find out, shall we? So during this cuddly time where everything feels really good, this feels like it's a life partner that is here for you. Um, they look like that, well, at least it feels that way right now, right? Right now, everything's just going mm -hmm. right. Everything's just perfect timing. Mm -hmm. And it's getting really mm -hmm. comfortable with that. Mm -hmm. Sorry, guys. One second. Do not disturb. Okay. Sorry about that. So you guys are getting really comfortable with each other, okay? You guys might like to literally sleep naked. Um, but the point is, it's kind of like, hmm. You might not be telling everyone that you're spending time with this person, though. It's almost like it's your little secret, okay? So you might not be telling everyone but it's, um, I heard a perfect entanglement. What does that mean? Let's keep going. You might go to their house a lot or uh, even like, um, this could even be like their official building. So maybe somewhere where they work. Okay, so I see you making your way to like their wherever their establishment is or wherever they spend most of their time and it looks like you guys kind of go into a room quietly and kind of do your thing your business not so quietly to be honest with you but um it's like you're kind of doing your business here but it does feel like not many people know only the select few, your friends or something like that, no. It does feel like you see this person maybe at their work a lot, okay? Um, and they might be like kind of sweaty. Or they might be, you know, a little dirty, kind of sweaty, a little dingy, okay? You don't give a fuck. You're like, that shit is hot, all right? Um, and even here, you're like, I don't care. Just do whatever the fuck it is that you do. I'll even do the rest if you're tired, okay? Um, so going into the second half of the month, let's see what we have going on here, okay? All right, so going into the second half of the month, this is someone that you know you can let your guard down with, okay? So you're letting your guard down. You're starting to, like, the second half of the month, it looks like you're starting to be a little more public. You're going out with them a little bit more. Okay, you might be, you know, riding together. I'm making my way downtown. Right? But overall, what's present here, I think someone sees you guys together and you're like, oh, I didn't know you guys were a thing. And then you're like, oh, well, yeah. So secret might be out when it comes to that. And... It's almost liberating that the secret's going to be out. And the reason why it's liberating is because now you can be as open, as loud, as whatever, as you want. Okay? So, 
How are we leaving the month? Leaving the month. It looks like someone wants to really please you, okay? And someone is really trying to give you a real offer, something real, and not just sex, it doesn't look like. Um, but they like having that control over you. And this could be because you're naturally a very strong, firm type of woman, okay? Um, or man, whatever it is to you. And the point is, they like the fact that with you, or with them, should I say, you kind of let that down, that guard down. This is you showing vulnerability. This is you letting them take control. And that feels empowering to them. Okay. So let's get some final messages for you here. So it looks like this month is really going to be about you guys planting the seeds together. Could be literally, you never know. Um, and really enjoying your quality time. That's like the biggest thing. So you have someone here. It may have started out as a little bit of a secret type of thing. Then someone may have found out and you're like, yeah, well, that's what it is. Like we're adults, right? Um, and then you're like, well, I'm glad that they found out about that because now we can like really be us. We don't have to hide at all. Um, so it looks like now you guys are transitioning towards the end of the month into that phase. So let's go into the extended reading portion of this. We're going to pull some cards now and see what we have going on, okay? So some things I want to find out is um, I want to see how they're actually feeling about you. That's important. What their intentions are, what their desires are, sexually too. Um, what we want... Do they have someone else in the picture? Like, is there anything you have to worry about? Um, and are they going to commit to you? You know, is it, or is it just sex? And of course, the final outcome. Let's do one more shuffle here. Okay, so how does your person feel about you? We'll do one more. What are their desires? What are their desires? What are their intentions with you? What are their true intentions? Is there someone else that you have to worry about? Is there someone else? What are some obstacles or anything, red flags that you have to worry about here? Will they commit? Or will it be just sex? And what is the final outcome for you two in December? What is the final outcome for you two? All right, Saggies, this is going to be your extended reading. Uh, if you're interested, click that description box down below. Follow me there. I will see you in the next one. Until next time, bye.